I've known Henry since I was six years old. I remember the first day we met. We travel through time. In fact, you and I are friends in the future, when you're a lady. There's no such thing as time travelers. Well, if you hang around long enough, you'll see me disappear. One second he was there, and the next, he was gone. I've been waiting for Henry my entire life. It's you. I wrote down every time that you came to visit me. You told me that you go back to the same places a lot. Yeah, it's like gravity. Big events pull you in. I was a big event. Is it too weird? No, I think it's kind of magical. I don't feel alone anymore. Will you marry me? No. I didn't mean that. <laughs> <laughs> of course. <laughs> We name her Alba. You met her? She's so beautiful. Daddy! I travel through time. I can't control it. It just happens. I wish it didn't. You're back. Did I miss Christmas? What do you want to talk about? How bad it feels to sit here and wait for you? I'm falling apart. What's wrong with me wanting one normal thing in my life? You think that I wanted this life? This husband that disappears? Who would want that? I have a choice. I never had a choice. I don't want you to spend your life waiting. Henry! I wouldn't change one second of our life together. I mean, this, this is unbelievable. There's no city like this in the world. You're in love with a fantasy. I'm in love with you. What are you, oh, what are you hey. doing here? Dad's here in business, and we just decided to reload a lot. Oh. <laughs> That's great. We can spend some time together. Well, I, I think nice. we have a lot of commitments, but I'm sure it's... We'll... What? Right. If I'm not mistaken, Rodin's work was influenced by his wife, Camille. Rose was the one. No, he was never married to Rose. I hope you're not going to be as antisocial tomorrow. I'm not quite as taken with him as you are. He's a pseudo-intellectual. Slightly more tannic than the 59. I prefer a smoky feeling. Carol and I are going to go dancing. Dancing? Oh. We heard of a great place. Interested? No, 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 no. Sure. I, I, I don't want to be a killjoy, but I, I, I need to get a little fresh air. Not that late. Yeah, I'll probably end up going on another little hike tonight. Where'd Gil run off to? I've been walking around Paris. Where do you think Gil goes every night? He walks and gets ideas. Mm -hmm. Why are you so dressed up? I was just doing a little writing. You dress up and put on cologne to write? Because you know how I think better in the shower and I get the, the positive ions going in there? I had a private detective follow him. And what happened? I don't know. The detective agency says the detective is missing. I'm in a very perplexing situation. My name is Tim, and this is the year that would change my life forever. Happy New Year! Happy New Year! I just didn't know it yet. Tim, my dear son, this is going to sound strange, but there's this family secret that the men in the family can travel in time. This is such a weird joke. It's not a joke. If it's true, which it isn't, although it is. But if it was, which it's not, which it is, how would I actually... You go into a dark place, clench your fists, think of the moment you're going to, and you'll find yourself there. Happy New Year! It's going to be a complicated year. It's going to be a complicated life. For me, it was always going to be all about love. I'm Tim. I'm Mary. It's my mother's name. I remind you of your mother. 
Mm. Obviously, I should have thought this through more. Could you give me one second? I'm Tim. I'm Mary. I love your eyes. Do you? I love the rest of your face, too. I haven't even looked further down, but I'm sure it's all fantastic. I'm sure it'll be better next time. Well done. Some people make a real mess of it the first time. Oh, amateurs. Some days you want to relive forever. Will you marry me? I think I'll go for... Yes. Some days you only want to live once. I am so uninterested in a life without your father. It never occurred to me that I might lose you. I never said you could fix everything. Not without consequences. It's so good to see you. We've never met before. Oh, no. What do I do? You have to use it to make your life the way you want it to be. I never know what the future holds, just like everyone else. Time catches up to all of us. My son. My dad. I try to live every day as if it was the final day of my extraordinary, ordinary life. I hope I see you again. You will. My whole life depends on it. Dad and I used to come out here, lay down, watch the lights change, watch them go from green to red to yellow. You could try it if you wanted to. No. That's your problem. You don't do what you want. Okay. And what happens if a car comes? You die. So here. Some of romances. No they are shooting stars. My mind is Spectacular moment of light in the heavens. My heart is heavy. You just tell me what you want. I'll be there for you. Fleeting glimpse of eternity. Here we go on the count three, okay? <laughs> Windsor Plantation. I'm going to buy it one day. I'm going to fix it up. Well, what about me? What do you want? I want a White House. Blue shadows. Okay. You promise? Promise. You sent the police for me? It is two in the morning. We sent the police. Professor Hamilton, all of this is my fault. He's a nice boy, but he's... He's what? He is what? trash! Daddy. Trash! Trash! Not for you! If you want not to see him anymore, and that's fine. He understands. <laughs> it's hard. He really does. Windsor Plantation, the dream house. You gotta be able to get it now. I think a lot about why we shouldn't get married. Ah! I love you. Marry me. For me. I hope you make the right choice. I know there's things you cannot tell me. But I also know there's a story here, and I think everybody will hear about it. Do you think your paper has the resources to take that on? I do. Do you? The Boston priest molested kids in six different parishes over the last 30 years. The church found out about it and did nothing. We haven't committed any long-term investigative resources to the case. No, we haven't. And that's the kind of thing your team would do. Spotlight. Guys, listen. Everybody's going to be interested in this. Obviously, the church will fight us very hard. I'm trying to get some background information. I don't want you recording this in any way, shape, or form. Nothing. We understand you've settled several cases against the church. I can't discuss that. There aren't any records of any of these settlements. Nope. When you're a poor kid from a poor family, and when a priest pays attention to you, it's a big deal. How do you say no to God? Spotlight. This is the tip line. You think he's got something? I want to keep digging. We need to focus on the institution. Show me that it came from the top down. 
They'll try to silence anyone who speaks out. You leave me alone, you hear me, goddammit? 6% act out sexually. 6% is 90. 90 priests. If there were 90 of these bastards, people would know. Maybe they do. You're going to give me the names and the names of their victims. Are you threatening me? I was doing my job. Yeah, you and everyone else. I am here because I care. We're going to tell this story. We're going to tell it right. I can't believe it. I'm hoping we can keep this between us until we all get on the same page. Is that why we're here, to get on the same page? We've got two stories here. A story about degenerate clergy and a story about a bunch of lawyers turning child abuse into a cottage industry. Which story do you want us to write? Because we're writing one of them. I'm not crazy. They control everything. This is not just Boston. It's a whole country. It's a whole world. They knew, and they let it happen. It could have been you. It could have been me. It could have been any of us. Yeah.